I love this story. It's very classic Comox Valley. Retire here from another province. Be active, enjoy the mountain, enjoy the sports and the landscape. And then our story takes a wonderful twist. It's all about back and forth and back and forth. It's not a, a straight line anymore for me. Our story takes a twist because Brian Buckrell retired here from a professional career as a professor. And he serendipitously visited a gallery, looked around and thought, perhaps I can be an artist too. I was a veterinarian. Um, I, I uh, worked in the area of reproductive technologies. I was a professor at the University of Guelph and research is very much, it's creative, um, it's fun in, in, in many respects. There's some downsides like there is to everything else, but the upside is that you're creating things. Uh, that creative bent is actually not dissimilar from, from art in some respects. Brian's art has been evolving through the years as he's become more confident in his skills and he's gone from merely representing what he's seen to more interpretation of what he's seen. And it's really lovely. My interest in painting is not to reproduce that as a photograph, but to try to take it and create something different with it. So these are examples. This is one I did yesterday. Uh, this is an example. And this is what, what I call a start. This is the first layer, and it will sit, and I'll refine it and add to it and do other things to it. But you can see the difference in the, I guess you'd call it punch, from the um, uh, photo. It's very hard to be creative and playful and inventive when you're first starting uh, as an artist. You want to reproduce what you see, that's how you learn how to mix paint and so on. As you get a little more experience, you take gambles. It's, it's just called artistic risk. You just take a risk and try something and you learn from it. My perspective is that I mean, you can see the paintings out there, everyone's entirely different. Every painting is an experiment for me and whatever happens to it, happens to it. And I'm a big believer in serendipitous change. I, I don't want to know the outcome, just let it happen. If I'm happy with it, great. If not, you junk it and start over. So. Brian has been welcomed into the Comox Valley Arts community. He's one of a number of artists that call the Comox Valley home. I think there's an awful lot of people here that are into art in various forms, um, and that's wonderful. And, and it's, I think because it's an aging community as well, the mo majority of the ones that I know here our seniors are close to it. Um, there are a number of young ones that are doing it professionally as well, but the bulk of them are uh, those that have moved on to try something new in their later years, and it's a great spot for that. So. This really is a classic Comox Valley story to come into this community and become part of it and even start teaching within that community and sharing your knowledge and your expertise. In the Comox Valley for Shaw TV, I'm Andrina Kusholti.